Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Let's Talk Line Boring. Question today is, how do I accurately measure the bore that I'm working on after I've done the rough cut so I know how much more I need to take to get to the desired finish diameter? So with this uh, BOA C45 we're using today, the first thing we do is we want to, the tool bits at the end here, we want to bring that tool bit back to the beginning of the bore. Uh, where we started, which is on the far end of this bore. And we have the option with this machine of either cranking it back, see it's moving back, moving my bar back, or I can uh, turn the uh, feed arm nut into neutral or disengage, and I can slide it back. Now you can see I just slided, slid the, uh, the tool bit back to pr where we started uh, started our, our cut. So. so the next thing I need to do is install my measure gauge. So I've already put together the, the kit. Now the kit consists of, these are dead ends we call them. These are extensions. And this is your spring loaded end here. These are your adapters here, these little square pieces. These are for the half inch tool port or three eighths tool ports. So the half inch tool ports are in the bigger bars and we just slide that adapter in and we have the spring loaded end already compressed in this measure gauge and we just slide it into the adapter here. So it's gonna look like that. So now we're gonna just use our crank here and just slowly bring Bring the tool into the bore about a quarter of an inch or so. All right, so now we're in there and we need to release the spring, the spring loaded end here by turning this little thumb screw. That pop means both ends are now touching the bore. And now we wanna tighten this back up. And then we'll crank this back so we can remove that snap gauge. Once we pull this, this snap gauge out, we have a very accurate uh, measurement of what the bore is. And you can just take calipers or, or a micrometer. Micrometer is the most accurate. And just, uh, we can just run this a little bit easier to hold it this way. Trying to do too many things here. So you bring it in and voila, you've got yourself your measurement of your bore. Next, we'll, on the next video, we're gonna talk about, and once you have this measurement, so you now know how much more you need to cut out of your bore, I'm gonna talk about how you adjust your tool bit accurately using the bore repair uh, bore tool adjuster kit. Thanks for watching.